tissue paper. It could be, you could use newspaper, paper towels, parchment paper. tape on the inside as well as the outside. I made a little notch in the log and just put some small indentations in with my fingernail. And I made a knot in the log. And next I believe I am going to put a branch coming out of the log. Made it with the aluminum. waiting for the glue to dry on the log um, I'll start on the fairy the fairy's house I think I'll make this 
um, the fairy's house out of this juice cotton. I will do the same process, the aluminum, aluminum foil, the tissue paper, the glue, and then the um, paper clay. And I carved out a little um, outlet entryway for the fairies to go in their house. I'm not sure if I'll keep the top on or not. I probably will. I want to keep the shape of the juice bottle. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, the log is dry. And now I'm waiting for the house to dry. As I said, I did the same technique on the house. And I am going to now use the paper clay. You could go online and Google how to make paper clay, or you could just purchase it from a regular, your local craft store. Okay, you want to put this um, paper clay as thin as possible because it takes a long time to dry, sometimes 24 hours to 48 hours. Okay, put it on as thin as possible. Okay, it has been 24 hours and the clay on the log has dried. So not, I am now going to apply my colors. You can color your tree any color you would like to use. I am going to start off by using the base as black. Then I'm going to add different hues of brown. And um, let it dry. Of course, you have to let it dry in between. So, uh, I have my black right here with my paintbrush. Wait, it's gonna make a mess. So, put it inside this. I'm gonna start off. Make sure you try to have complete coverage. Once it dries, you can.
you're not going in the crevices, you're not looking for full coverage. Okay, can you see that? How it's starting to look more like a tree. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, while I am waiting for everything to dry, I cut this foam, uh, this floral foam in half, and I am going to build a fence with these wooden sticks. You can cut your wooden sticks um, however you want to cut it, but I got these from um, the canvas. When you buy canvas posters, you get these little sticks um, that are attached to them. So I am going to use my hot glue gun to attach it to the floral. Stay tuned. Okay, my tree stump is all done. It's dry. So um, I'm waiting for the fairy house to dry and that will take about 24 hours. And I already had my my moss pads that I glued down on this little lid. And this you can get from the Dollar Tree. Um, I have my indentations where I'm going to put um, bark, and I'm going to use white rocks. And I, uh, we'll see how it looks from there. Okay, stay tuned.